Hey, a pleasant good afternoon, Royals fans. After a 9-2 absolute pounding of the Newfoundland Growlers last evening, the running Royals today at 5.30 look to get the Newfoundland Growlers excuse me, again in two games straight in a two-game winning streak. Now, after losing the main Mar Mariners the timeout before, they won 9-2 led by Trevor Gooch and Tomas Ebbing clearly as the stars of the game. Last game, both had a hat trick making up for six of the goals as they look to carry their hot play into this evening, as well as Jacob Pritchard, Patrick Bykoff, who looked very good in that game as well, who have been good throughout the entirety of the season. Trevor Gooch has been great since coming back from overseas and back to our Reading Royals, and Tomas Ebbing has been great since coming into the fold this season, uh, since basically the jump, and um, really has been a fine player this entire season for the team. Uh, when it comes to tonight's game, Obviously, there was no goals in the first period of last game. Well, the only literal thing you can say that could be improvement uh, from last game is maybe score the first goal and maybe get something in the first. But other than that, this team played swimmingly. They played like absolute warriors out there last game. They were blocking shots. They were doing everything they had to do. They were jamming the uh, growlers. They were playing well on the boards. They were getting good transitional uh, chances. The, Ro the Royals really, after that first period, um, that there was no scoring on either end, seemed to go in, get completely zoned in on what they had to do in the next two to be able to draw mistakes by the Growers and then pounce on them and capitalize on them, and that's exactly what they did to get that 9-2 to two win yesterday. That's exactly how they're going to be able to uh, win this game again. They just got to play very smart hockey. Um, it's one of the... Uh, best teams in the league, the second place team in the division. It's very um, great and a huge accomplishment that the Reading Royals even beat them 9-2. to two. I don't see that happening, obviously, back-to-back -back games. I would love to see it happen. But I do think Tomas Ebbing, Trevor Gooch, they've been great as a whole. They haven't been scored hat-tricks every night, but they've been great as a whole. I think they'll be good again. But my player to watch out for tonight is Patty Bykoff. He's been throwing around. I think he might get a couple tonight. Uh, he's been really playing well lately. He's been throwing... Um, his entire talents around out there. Um, Jacob Pritchard, I always think, looks good every night. And then Dominic Cormier, obviously Evan Cormier was the goaltender for the Newfoundland Growlers uh, yesterday. Dominic Cormier, I think, will be huge uh, tonight for the Reading Royals on defense. He's been good the entire season. I love how he has the ability to get a shot through in really any uh, capacity where there could be three guys in front of him, and he seems to always tend to find a lane to get the sloppy but good goal uh, on the rebounds in front and on the plays where there's just a lot of traffic in front, so I really appreciate that about him. But this has been a preview to the Red and Royals and Newfoundland Growls. This one's a little bit shorter since I already did a preview on the games earlier this week, as obviously we're playing three of the same team this week. Play great in Game 1. Look to play great again in Game 2. Let's make it two in a row, Redding, against the Newfoundland Growlers up there in Newfoundland, and take two away from them at home, even though they do not have the home faithful there, unfortunately, for the Growlers in front of them. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe and enjoy the game, and go Royals. Let's get another win tonight. Peace, everybody.